Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if your Skype microphone is not working properly. So this is probably going to be an issue across other platforms and services as well. It's not just Skype. So in this tutorial, I'm going to hopefully be able to walk you guys through how to resolve it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu. Just left click on the start button one time. Type in microphone. Open up the start menu. Type in privacy. Best match should say privacy settings. You want to left click on that one time. So now underneath privacy settings, you want to go and left click on microphone. So go on the left side underneath app permissions and then left click on microphone. Please keep in mind Microsoft changes Windows 10 so frequently now that it might be located in a slightly different spot when you guys watch this tutorial. This is just really taking you down the direction at the time of this recording and it should pretty much carry over as well so just don't be mad if you have to click somewhere else but we're basically trying to get to the microphone settings here. And now that we are on this side here you want to go and make sure where it says allow apps to access your microphone you want to make sure this is turned in the on position. And then underneath where it says choose which apps can access your microphone, you want to scroll down until you get to Skype. And there should be an oval one here. You want to turn that to the on position. So that should allow the Skype to actually turn on your microphone or gain access to your microphone settings. And finally, if you close out of here, if you did open up your Skype program and then went up to the top right corner where the three buttons are and left click on settings, there would be something that said underneath microphone. So again, click on microphone and then there'd be a drop down menu. You could select your correct microphone input device from there and that should hopefully resolve it as well. Additionally, you can go through the add or remove program functionality in Windows and actually remove Skype and then go ahead and reinstall it. So just trying to give you guys a few different options here. So I do hope one of these methods was able to help resolve your issue. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.